In this video, I'm going to show you how to buy Tron if you're a US citizen living in the US of A. Now, what I'm about to show you doesn't only apply to the USA citizens. I mean, this is a good video if you're looking to buy Tron for the very first time and you're not sure where to start. But the main focus for this video is for USA citizens. So the two websites that I'd like to introduce you is one called eToro.com, and you'll find a link for that below the video. And the other one is Binance.us. So let's first have a look at Binance.us. And if we come to trade and we just go to markets here, and if you look down these markets, you won't find Tron. Now, the thing is with the US market, the Binance US, you can register with your bank account, you know, wire transfer, or you can use a credit card. So if you were going to go the route down uh, of buying Tron, you would register with Binance if you want to use the Binance.us. You'd buy another cryptocurrency like Ethereum or Bitcoin. Now, once you've got that Ethereum or Bitcoin, then the simple thing to do is if you want to get that into Tron, you transfer that to a wallet where you can do that transaction. And the wallet I like to use is Exodus.com. Now, this wallet here, I've got one I'm going to show you in a moment. You can download it to your desktop. This works on your desktop or your computer. You can also put it on your Android phone. I've got it on my phone. And you can also have it on an iPhone as well. But I'm going to show you how it works on desktop. So let's imagine that you've gone, you've created an account on Binance and you've connected it to your bank account or you're using your credit card and you want to buy Bitcoin. So you buy Bitcoin on Binance.us. Once you've got the Bitcoin, you'd withdraw that and send it over to your Exodus wallet. Now, once you get it into your Exodus wallet, so if I go to wallets here, um, this is a Bitcoin. I've got it shown in pounds. Uh, so you would click on receive. You'd get an address like this. You'd copy that address. You'd take that over to Binance and you'd send the Bitcoin to here. Now, once you've got your Bitcoin in your wallet, and as you can see, I've got 115 pounds worth sitting in there. Uh, that could be dollars, obviously. Then at the top here, you've got these uh, arrows, an orange one and a blue one, uh, one pointing forward, one pointing backwards. If you click on that, that's the exchange screen. Now, when you come here, uh, you've got all these cryptocurrencies that you can choose from, but I've chose uh, Tron, and I've also got Bitcoin in this one here. So I've got Bitcoin there. So I'm just going to say £100, and then all you would do is you click on this button that says exchange. Now, Exodus will do the exchange for you. It will take about five to ten minutes at the most, and then you'll have Tron inside your Exodus wallet. And once you've got the Tron inside your wallet, you'd come back over to wallets, You'd look for Tron uh, here, which I've got Tron. I've not got anything in there. And this time you click on send and you'd send that to wherever you want to send it. You put the address in. So if you were going to send it to your Tron link wallet, you'd come up to your Tron wallet. You'd come up to there and uh, you'd copy that address. You'd take that back over to Exodus. You'd pop that in there. And then in here, you'd either put the amount of Tron that you want to transfer or the amount that you want in the fiat currency. In my case, it's pounds. But if you're in the USA, it would obviously show as dollars. So that's one method that you could use to buy Tron. Okay. So just to summarize, you'd create an account on Binance.us. You would buy Bitcoin or Ethereum on uh, Binance.us with either your credit card or a bank transfer. Once you've got the Bitcoin or Ethereum into your Binance.us account, You'd send that over to uh, a wallet like Exodus where you could exchange it for Tron and then you can put that Tron into your Tron Link wallet. That's one route that you could go. Now, the next route is with eToro.com. Now, again, everything that I cover in this video, you'll find the links below. Now, eToro. So I, I'm not in the US, so I wanted to check 100% if you could use eToro to buy uh, Tron um, and actually use it in the USA. So what I did was I sent them a, a support ticket, and this is the reply I got. Uh, we could see that you're logged in from the UK, so they could see that I was in the UK, but the question I asked was, could I, as a US citizen, connect my bank account or a credit or debit, debit card? It says, kindly note that US citizens cannot open account outside the USA due to the US regulations. So if you're a US citizen and you want to use eToro, 
you have to be in the US to do it. If you're a US citizen, you're in London or you're in France, you know, uh, or you're somewhere else in the world, world, you won't be able to use eToro. However, clients in the US can deposit using a debit card, it says there, or through a, a wire transfer. So they can do it through a bank transfer or they can use a, a debit card. So they can use um, a card that's connected to their bank account to actually uh, buy cryptocurrency on eToro. Now I've got an account with these, so I'm gonna log in because what I want to do is I wanna look at the crypto to see if we can see Tron on the list. So I'll click on log in and I'll sign in. So here's the uh, trade markets down the side here. So let's just have a look to see if they've got one that says crypto. You know, so we go to the trade markets and as you could see here, we've got crypto. So if I go on the crypto screen, and then what I'm looking for is Tron. As you can see, I've got Bitcoin, Ethereum, Dash, XRP uh, coming down a little bit further. And there we go. There's the Tron one there. So you can click on buy. And then what that's going to do is take you to a screen like this. OK, um, and you're just going to you're, you're, you're just going to put in there how much you want to buy. Deposit a uh, $1,000 in order to open a trade. Um, and I could come down as low let's just see how low it says to deposit it says 40 to open a trade yes so uh, you need to deposit $25 okay the minimum is $25 so the minimum you can use is $25 on eToro so you just click open a trade and that would be opening a trade and that would be depositing your fiat currency your your dollars into eToro and they're going to give you Tron now once you've got the Tron it's again simple. You would withdraw the Tron and put it up here into your Tron Link wallet. So I hope you found that video helpful. Now, if you're interested in a passive income with Tron, then I'd like to introduce you to Johnny Blockchain. This is where you can earn a passive income with your Tron, make your portfolio profitable for you, earn a passive income of up to 125% via the Tron smart contract. And uh, if you look here, you can see across the top here, there's 362 people using the site. We've been launched about just over a month now at the time of making this video. This is how much Tron that we've paid out to date. This is the average uh, return uh, for the last 30 days. That's what the average return is per day. And this is the top earner in the last 24 hours. And if you look here, you can see the uh, daily returns that is being given since the, the 14th of uh, July up to the 27th. There's all the dates there. If you're interested in joining Johnny Blockchain, you'll find a link below this video. If you click on that link, it will take you over to a page just like this where you can pop your name and your email address in, and I'll keep you up to date with all of the passive incomes that I'm currently working with, and I'll give you some more details on Johnny Blockchain. You have a fantastic day. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please give me the thumbs up and make sure you click that subscribe button and click on the bell notification so you get notified when I upload a new video. You have a great day. Bye now.